Yeah, hi. Uh, hi. Um, so, as I stated before, I'm what is known as a creative technologist. It's kind of a, a, a space uh, in, the, in the marketing industry here, uh, which, is, uh, which has some resemblance to uh, product, product management. So, someone who sits in between the digital producer uh, and the development team. So, uh, my role is basically to sort of communicate between these, between these two uh, that, that are not, well, uh, well, usually don't speak the same language. So, w when I saw the, 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 the people here and uh, what they do, so that when, when they sent uh, the list on Thursday, I think it was, uh, I saw it's a, it's a very diverse crowd, so I just thought of just show... Uh, a bit of web communities, hopefully uh, you won't know a few and, and that will um, uh, sort of enlighten you on, on what's going on, uh, what's the future possibility of, uh, possibilities of, of, uh, of web communities. Um, so I'll, I'll start with the, with the, the first one. Uh, I have... Oh. Sorry. So... Uh, Runkeeper, uh, if you can help me out, who knows Run Runkeeper? I'm going to ask that for, for every every uh, every one of the communities. So Runkeeper is uh, is an interesting uh, solution that I really really love and I use it. Um, it's an iPhone application uh, which started just by measuring someone's uh, uh, run, but ever since Nike and Adidas uh, came into the into the same uh, field and they offered the same kind of products that they, they, they uh, needed to, to really change themselves and, and transform the product. So what they built is a, is a, is a uh, web community on top of that. And what, what does it mean? It means that they, uh, during the, the uh, New York Marathon uh, about a month and a half ago, uh, you were able to track your, uh, your mates running, cheer them while they were running. And that's one of the... Uh, Interesting thing, interesting aspects of, of, of a web community on top of, a, of an existing product uh, and reinventing it. Um, my next uh, example is Instagram. Who knows Instagram? Cool. So Instagram is, is, is just crossing, I think, to the mainstream. Uh, Instagram is doing whatever we all do, is taking, taking photos, but... Uh, um, Adding a, a more artistic layer to it, and actually, and actually, sort of focusing its community rather than everybody's doing picture sharing. Let's focus on on the more artistic uh, 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 people there that can that that really appreciate aesthetics. And uh, and what's interesting here is it's it's not a web application. You can only access it through your mobile. Um, you take picture, it will, uh, it will do some nice, nice effects to it and will spread it through Twitter. So, um, so that's another thing. Who knows Twitter? Who's, who's using Twitter here? Okay, so quite a lot. So Twitter is the mechanism uh, for spreading your, your uh, images, but uh, for the people who don't use Twitter, they needed to add also the functionality of, uh, of following people, of, of, of me uh, liking a certain person and, and getting just the, the pictures that he's sending out. Uh, and it's an, amazing, it's an amazing product that they, they grew to be five, six million users within nothing, within a month and a half. Uh, so we see, we see communities taking ownership of a, of a very narrow uh, crowd. Uh, and this is this 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 one uh, uh, is actually one of my favorites nowadays, mostly because I'm getting paid for it. Uh, but uh, these guys are uh, Mark Zuckerberg at at one point uh, when uh, um, when people were complaining about privacy in the, on the net, he said, "Well." Uh, it's, it's like privacy does not exist anymore, shouldn't exist anymore. And that's the focus, I think, in, in Facebook in general. Facebook is opening, is, 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 
is, is going against everything that was known before. Beforehand, you had forums which people, where, where people you, were hidden behind aliases. Facebook opened everything up with your real name. So eToro is an is a investment, uh, investment platform for uh, investing in uh, commodities, gold, uh, 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 silver, and forex. Uh, and they said, why won't we do the same opening the, co opening the community for something that was closed behind behind a closed curtain before so they're releasing I don't know why it's not working but basically maybe I'm not connected but basically you go to to this to this uh, uh, open book and you can start following people around you can start following people who's actually making transactions who's actually investing so it's it's practically like listening to 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 uh, tracking one of your in investors and I heard Someone is talking about this phenomenal investor that, that made a lot of money. So this platform actually allows exactly that. You can follow people and track whatever they're doing and, and do, do just the same. And that's, that's again, opening everything and, and a very focused community. Um, unique looks. A uh, unique look, sorry. Unique looks just, just uh, uh, released this thing. Hundreds of blogs covering fashion. How can a company take ownership of being cool, of being uh, 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 the most well, mostly most uh, hipster, uh, hip, uh, hipster fashion, whatever? So you need you need look just by having people crowdsource and and being able to upload information to this to this platform that they that they built. They, 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 they became the, 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 the cool, the, 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 the one that, that is doing, that is taking the ownership for, uh, for being cool, for being, for being a hipster look, whatever. Um, so I, I don't know how am I uh, with time, so about uh, done. So let me just uh, t talk two minutes about tools and then... So all of all of these things, all of these uh, uh, communities are uh, built on 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 basically the notion that I want to take a niche and I want to create something in it. And the question is how me, you guys can can do that. And uh, I I just show you uh, uh, two well I just mentioned two tools that that you can take ownership of of a certain niche. Um, Genie. Uh, or GNIP, uh, which I have no idea what it means, basically connects you to, uh, to all the streams that are available on the, on the net. YouTube, Flickr, uh, uh, um, uh, Twitter, uh, a, a, lot of different, a lot of different things. Facebook, of course. And you can uh, basically track and aggregate all the information that is, going, that, that is happening on a certain on a certain keyword or keywords, so I'm doing now a a, a project for Jeff Daniels, uh, taking on ownership on 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 festivals, on music festivals, uh, and what what we do is basically we aggregate everything that is happening on the web, covering it or or skinning it uh, in a in a very nice uh, Jack Daniels experience uh, site, and we take ownership. We try to take ownership. On, on a certain on a certain uh, subject, uh, and and uh, and actually, it wasn't available before. It's it's a it's a whole new thing. We're talking about a few weeks of of, of from releasing these products. So uh, if you want to start stuff and taking ownership and getting a lot of information on a certain subject, I would recommend either seeing uh, this. Uh, um, um, Platform data set or uh, GNIP, and at that point, I think I'll finish. Mm -hmm. <laughs>